and unplugged. Here's Even another not, live performance go. from 95 Will Rock Studio East. I love today. And you want to know why? Because it's raining and like a storm is here. And it's kind of a perfect storm going on here today in Studio East. Welcome back, guys. Well, thank you hey. very Great much. Great to be here. You know, I knew that it was going to rain. We've had, I think they said on the news yesterday, 15 days with no rain. And then like a storm gets on the calendar. And here's the first day of freezing temperatures and rain. So thank you, Do you very know, much. Do you know no one's ever Ever made that joke before? No, no one's one. ever made a, a, a comparison between our band name and the weather. You're, really? the, you're literally the first person. But I find that really hard to believe because you guys brought the. It rain is hard to believe. To hard to believe. Everyone says it's that. hard to believe I'm because he's lying you to you. We've heard that a million to times. Rock on the range this year. Don't yes. blame us. Yes, I. I who else are we going to blame? Well, we like sunshine. We do. So yeah. if we had a choice, see, it's not raining in New Zealand at the moment. Right, so you leave there and they get the weather that we should have. Okay, when we go back in February, it's always summertime. Right, and here it will be storming. Explain that You're one. You're right, I got nothing. Whoa. Uh -huh. I got Mind, nothing. Mind uh -huh. blowing. Mind blowing. Where's the conspiracy <laughs> oh, <God>. now? <laughs> you know what I was also thinking is that the last time you guys were here, it was a holiday, the big national holiday of Talk Like a Pirate Day. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And today, it's another holiday, but it's it's kind of a lame one. It's National Coffee Day. You take that back. Coffee is the heart and soul of this No, brand. believe me. Like, I run on coffee. But yesterday was National Drink You're saying day. some very hurtful <sighs> things about it. Could we not have come in yesterday? <laughs> <laughs> what? Could we not have come in yesterday on National Drink Beer Day? I know, it really would have turned I things up. I think the significance of being at a band is that every day is National Drink Beer Day. Yeah, yeah, you're you right. You don't have to wait for that to roll around. No. You, like, if you want to have a beer any day, you, you have that. Well, I'm going to start doing that now, and then if anybody questions, it'll be like, like a storm says, yeah. that in their world, the it's National Drink Beer Day. The foreigners told me it was okay. Day. Yeah, so. yeah, see, <laughs> see? Well, it's nice to have you guys here. I know Thank for you. a while you were in here like every month, and it's been a little bit now, so it's nice to have you back. And you're on tour with Season after and otherwise the brothers in arms tour i know obviously you guys saw me on thursday i'm gonna see you this coming thursday yes. too but how's everything going so far you sounded great seems like things are off to a good start well thank, thank you, you. Sa sound almost surprised when you say yeah, that yeah well you, you, mean sounded, you sounded great, great. you sounded great actually, actually not bad <laughs> <laughs> well i guess if it sounded bad i'd be like so uh, what's your perception of yeah. how things are going yeah, we're getting into <laughs> we're focusing more on dance moves this tour yeah. less on the music more into yeah, dance yeah chris moves. has like mm. six wardrobe changes yeah. i noticed that yeah. i noticed thank that you. thank you for like noticing the madonna of like a storm well if you didn't notice what would be the point in doing it you're right you're so, right I will you say that, it. and I know this is, this is radio and nobody can see it, but that'll give them an incentive to go on Thursday to the Tree of Joliet. But I like the new mirrors with the Ouija board, with the candles, like cool, cool set things. Thank you. That's, that's pretty neat. That's new from the last time I'd seen you, so that's great. Yeah, as I say, it's just more about dancing, so we want to see ourselves dance. <laughs> the that's where the mirrors come in. Right. Well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that not only can we see you, but then we can see the reflection. Yeah, well, when we're yeah, doing exactly. choreography, yeah, we were right. watching ourselves. Down, so we want to take that on the road. Right. Well, if you want to break some of that out right now, you can, or else uh, you can just play for us. What's up? Uh, what's yeah, I think song? we'll just play today. <laughs> just today? just okay. it's radio. You Actually, know, I don't I want to waste the dance I haven't done moves. my stretches as well. So. Well, if you'd like to, we yeah, are just... streaming this live as it's happening <laughs> at 95willrock.com if you'd like to watch. But uh, what's the first song you guys want to do for us? Well, we might play our new single, which you guys have been nice enough to play as well. A little song called Become the Enemy. All right, we are live with Like a Storm in Studio Special, East. Special uh, dance version. Are you going to dance to this one? Mario's going to dance. Oh, I am. <laughs> for, for all the people watching online. <laughs> right. You've become the enemy. Yeah. you for what you've become and I hate you you know what you've done to me you can't look me in the eye I want you to see that I won't be your lifeline Become the enemy, but you won't be the enemy. 
You've become the enemy Stole my soul And it's like you died before you were born Like Jesus Christ with devil's horns Sucking me down your black hole Give back the life, the love you stole That you've done So look me in the eye I want you to see That I won't be your lifeline But you'll be the death of me You've become the enemy But you won't be the enemy You've become the enemy Stole my soul And it's like you died Before you were born Like Jesus Christ With devil's horns Sucking me down Your black hole Give back the life The life you stole Right, do you want to do some dancing or should we do didgeridoo? I want to hear didgeridoo dancing. I want to <laughs> you dance, I'll do didgeridoo. Really? Will Thank Rock, you. The Rock Station, live in Studio East with Like a Storm. Like the acoustic version of that. That's the first time you've done that here. Actually, the last time that you were here, that song wasn't even it was out on the record, but it wasn't out yeah. as a single yet. I think Wish You Hell had just hit. True. So for, yeah. for Pirate Day. Yeah, yeah. It, yeah. Was, it was kind of perfect. But yeah, I like I like that version. Do you like breaking down your songs into acoustic? Is that how you write them? I mean, we prefer to dance, but if we must play. <laughs> but if we must. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> Well, I figure I think you figured out a way to do it well. <laughs> and, uh, Thanks, definitely, of course, broke out the didgeridoo on that one. And the next tour that I saw you just announced today is the didgeridoo destruction oh, tour. Oh which yeah! Is awesome. Doesn't it feel cool to say? Yeah, <laughs> it's a tongue twister. The didgeridoo, didgeridoo destruction. <laughs> like it's awesome. Yeah. This November. <laughs> and I saw failure anthem and from ashes to new. Totally digging from ashes to new. And we oh, had failure yeah, anthem actually it. at Will Rock Fest. So it's, it'll that'll be a good one. And no dates announced yet, right, for that one? Just that it's going to kick off in November. I saw it's going to kick off at the Machine Shop, but nothing. It is November sixth, and we're also going to be playing uh, Chicago. You know, at the start of the tour. So. Oh, so you are coming through. Well, I liked what we were doing with the mystery thing. We just announced a tour and no dates. Oh yeah, ever. yeah. Well, well, it's going to be an incredible tour. Actually, no dates. We, we never said that we were going to be on the tour. We just announced that there was a tour, but we never said that we were going to be on it. Yeah. Oh. It's it's the didgeridoo destruction tour we, with from Ashes. It just to New sounded Taylor. good, so, <laughs> <laughs> so we put it. No, no like a storm. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a good thing you are, or else that might be a little confusing. It'd be kind of weird, right? It would be. We just need like, well, you could come and play didgeridoo. You've got one at home. Yeah, and you know what? 
what? Okay, so Stu and I, one day, I don't know where Stu went, but he came in the studio, he was practicing it, and he actually did a really good job. Then I started blowing on it, and I didn't do so hot. I know. What, okay. <laughs> <laughs> like what you and Stu do when you're off the air is your own business. <laughs> <laughs> bottom line is that Stu, I believe, will be guest didgeridooing before he's me. He's doing awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's great. The man's natural. Yeah, he is. So Eddie, if he wants to come back from behind the curtain, I know it's still here. We left it here so we could practice. He could be the special guest downtime. on that tour, too. There we He's go. actually the headliner. Yeah. Didgery <laughs> Stew. <laughs> the the Didgery Stew. Didgery Stew Distraction <laughs> Tour. That could be something different. <laughs> there it is. It's a done deal now. All right. So you will be coming back uh, through Chicago at some Absolutely. point. Absolutely. We will be. Very good. We so will. Rock. See, see what see I'm what saying? See what we did there? There you go. See what we're Very doing? Good. Very good. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you ready to do another one? No. All right. Yes. <laughs> you really, you had me going for a while there. Yeah, yeah, we might do a I mean, little, you can keep going little wish you, you how. We yeah. don't have any more songs. That's a... We're, we're going to do Become the Enemy again. <laughs> <laughs> and we can keep talking if you need to keep tuning. Well, he's a, you know, he's a professional. All right, well, let's keep talking while he's tuning then. Let's but, talk. But uh, uh, obviously you're in the area, and I yes. mentioned Rock on the Range earlier, how you guys brought the rain to Rock on the Range. Thank so you. doing big festivals like that, you did Sonic Boom on Saturday, you've got Louder Than Life coming up this yeah. weekend. But then, you know, obviously you play these smaller venues too. Do you have, you know, one of those settings that you prefer more than others? Or what, what's your favorite part about kind of each of those different settings? Because obviously they are totally different. On the big stages, there's more room for some of our choreography to really translate, <laughs> yeah. you know, the pirouettes, the high kicks, <laughs> in a club setting that can be a bit more dangerous. But uh, I don't know. I mean, th they're all cool. They're all know? fun for clubs, different. The clubs are awesome clubs. because people are right there in front of you. Right. You know? and, and then festivals are amazing because it's just like, you people have thousands as far and as you thousands can of people, right? And and like I saw some pictures that were taken on the stage just from Saturday. You know, of you guys back here, and the only thing you saw were maybe the tops of tens, but it was just a sea of people. It was crazy. So that's got to be that's got to be a cool feeling too. And I, you know, I love to like go in the crowd when we do a couple of the songs at those shows. And those festivals, it's like the stage is like twelve foot high, mm -hmm. so I've got to jump off that and hope that they catch you. And then it's like a get back out of the crowd and I've got to find a way to get back on stage right? within 30 seconds and so I have to run around the It gets stage. pretty uh, athletic. Yeah. So from that point of view, that's how you keep your, your form. Well, thank you for <laughs> noticing. I mean, it's, it's mostly healthy eating and Pilates. Uh, <laughs> <but> thank you. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> much better options. <laughs> Alright, you guys ready to do another sure, one? Sure yeah. Oh, you All mean, right. yeah, we, we occasionally play music right. too. We are live with Like a Storm in Studio East. You rip my heart away. Oh Lord, I wish you had. Rip my heart away. Oh yeah. Oh Lord, I wish you had. When you know you got the best of me for the last time Save your precious little lives Cause I won't waste another moment in the wake of your demise So long you rip my heart away Walk on, I wish you had And I wish you had Of the ones you've left behind Faith won't lesson A lesson never learned You're gonna get what you deserve And I wish you hell And I wish you hell Walk out now oh, So long I wish you hell
Thank you. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. 95 Gold Rock, the rock station live. <clears throat> Excuse me, a 95 Gold Rock studio. We have that effect on people. Up. It's okay. Yeah, Don't yeah, worry about that's it. That's what it was. Just was very right now. Natural. emotional right there. <laughs> <laughs> but, guys, I can't believe I waited this long because congratulations are in order that not only did you uh, just have your third song crack the top 40, but top 25. Thank, Thank you. Thank congratulations. You. Thank you. Gosh, Thank you. I remember when the first song got in the top 40, and we yeah. were excited about that. And now, like, this is crazy. Well, thanks to you guys, man. Honestly, we, we couldn't have done it without you. Well, it's a good thing you play good music. Because if you didn't, then I don't think you'd be thanking me. We play good music poorly. Right. Let's cut yeah. that. <laughs> good, good music poorly. Well, it's working for you. And, you know, not only, I mean, in, in the charts, you know, charts are uh, an indication of how you're doing. But charts aren't kind of the end, the end all be all. You know, I don't base what my I like necessarily on that. But obviously, it's a factor. But what would you say just, you know, I remember when you guys were first starting out, you know, and, and now you guys are on the road all the time. You're putting out records. You've got this huge fan base. What would you say is something or, you know, if you could give some advice to a band that was in your position just maybe a couple years ago on, you know, what has kind of led to all this for you guys? I think, I mean, for us, obviously, playing music that we really believe in, you know, I mean, we kind of produced like the EP that had Love the Way You Hate Me on it and we made it just for ourselves and for our fans and um, you know radio stations like you guys started picking it up and playing it and it um, I don't know it allowed us to keep making music that we believed in rather than just like trying to do something that we thought mm -hmm. someone might like yeah it's kind of ironic that you know when we just ignored the rest of the world and just wrote whatever we felt whatever we wanted to play that's the music that has gotten out there and that's the music that seems to connect with people the When most. usually it seems that bands have success when they do the opposite of that. Yeah. yeah. So I like that I like that that's worked out for you that you have been able to keep doing what you're doing and then that's what's getting noticed. Not somebody telling you you need to write a hitch song and this is how you're going to do it kind my, of thing, you know. Yeah. My advice would be uh Put didgeridoo in your song. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or if that's not cool totally. anymore, I'm not sure if that's not cool anymore. Maybe the oboe, you know. So. <laughs> oboe metal. The French oboe horn. metal. The I French think, horn. I think that would add the, a little the something. The sousaphone. Ooh. Yeah. Good. <laughs> no. <laughs> not the skin flute. No, we don't. We don't need that. That's another project <laughs> we're working on. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't doesn't translate that well onto audio recording. But that will be online also. <laughs> I mean, it, it could it could be a factor in making a hit record, but uh, you know, <laughs> hopefully you know. not. But you know, I was talking about your fans before that I've even seen at every show that I've been to. Even the other night at that show that I was at in Indiana when I saw you guys, I saw more like a storm shirts there. And it was it was awesome to see, and I see them, you know, at every festival I go to, I'm always seeing like a storm merch everywhere, and it's cool. But I think that that's one thing that you guys do really well is how you connect with your fans, even you know, night of shows, just being out there and hanging out, taking pictures. I know a lot of bands do that, but you know, you guys offer the VIP experiences, you host the stage at shows, which is awesome. Do you actually do you wanna you wanna tell people what you do with those stage at shows? Because I kind of got on the stage at wagon a little late, and I love them. You're it's basically now, what we're doing now. Yeah, actually, it's pretty yeah. awesome. We actually have one. Coming up on October sixth. Thank you. Great, great plug, by the way. Yeah, see, it's kind of like we talked about <laughs> it. It's like we it's didn't. like what we're doing here. It's like an online acoustic show, so you can tune in from anywhere in the world and, and listen to us talk. Completely we've done nonsense. them. Talk absolute rubbish. We've done them in uh, Toronto. We've done them in Chicago. We've done them in Denmark, New Zealand. New Zealand. You can uh, watch Frankfurt. them. Yeah, the last Worldwide, one that I seen baby. was when you yeah. guys were out with Tremonti. It was somewhere yep. over in Europe. Yeah, it was in you Frankfurt. It. it was funny too because with the time zones, we had to get up at like two in the morning to do it. Oh right. Yeah. Get up, right. and then uh, I think we were already up at two in the morning. <laughs> exactly. Do you want to tell people how they can find right. how they can log in to find these performances? Mm. Well, you can go to our uh, Facebook page, Like a Storm, with the little blue tick beside it good to know and uh everything you need is right there isn't yeah. it yeah and next one's going to be um from the tour bus Ooh. oh yeah, yeah. oh yeah October 6th. so we'll get a little inside be there or be a look square. we're going to get take you on a tour of people's <laughs> bunks and yeah the well the crew's showering go, yeah. right. yeah, yeah. go through the internet history yeah. <laughs> it's going to be real right. interesting. That, that might be something. <laughs> so do you guys want to do one more song for us while you're here? We'd love to do one sure. more song. All right. We do. you have one more that you might know? No. Well, no, you just want to fake it? Yeah. All right. Alabama? Yeah. Good music poorly, right? <laughs> Good music poorly. Yeah, get that, a, get that on a business. Get that on a t-shirt. Like a storm. <laughs> That's what our tour should be called. Good music poorly. <laughs> that, that'll be the next one after yeah. the didgeridoo <laughs> destruction. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is a song from our record called Break Free.
myself I'm stuck here again And I can't see That I'm not digging my way out I'm digging my grave I become my own demise Paralyzed inside my mind Arms are weak from holding up this front no escaping, no surprises Complicated compromises Hold me down And all I really want Is just to break free Break free Break free from everything Break free before it breaks me there's got to be another way to start again. Tell me how you can be the brightest star and light up the sky. When I can't see To even light up my own way And I'm burnt out from trying I'll become what I despise Paralyzed inside a lie Arms too weak from holding back the flood Sinking as the waters rise Drink myself to sleep each night I'm going under And all I really want Is just to break free Break free Break free from everything Break free before it breaks me There's got to be another I wasn't thanking you, I was thanking Mario. Station. Hang on, what? <laughs> man, Chris said thank you, but I said I was actually thanking Mario. Oh. oh. Lead singers, man. They're so, jeez, so, yeah, so egocentric, you know? I mean, hey, I'll take it. I'll hey, you know what I was remembering? What? We Tell demoed me. that song in Wisconsin. You did? True yeah. story. Really? Yeah, we did. We did. Where was that at? In a hotel. Uh, we hotel. made that whole, that first I part mean, of the record in hotels. You guys were on the road. Yeah. 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 Yeah, we I actually we that. have a version of that mix that has "Break Free Madison" written on it. So ah, true story. Very cool. That was the only song that you did hear, though. Well, well, we were only here for two days. Cut us some slack, yeah. oh, man. Yeah. One, one song, <laughs> yeah, two days is pretty good, isn't it? Two days, you might as well start She's moving like, your stuff. She's like, that's and boring. <laughs> what else did you do? <laughs> <laughs> that's like, I, I kind of forgot. Like, tour, you're only here for a night. Yeah, yep. so two days, that's a, that's an eternity for you guys. You guys are going to be, are you like playing tonight? You're not playing in the Akron show tonight. No, we're going to no. be playing in uh, Joliet on Thursday. Yes, on Thursday at the Tree, which was Mojo's. And you guys have played that venue before. We have. We have, with Drowning Pool. 
Yes. Okay. And then you have the Stage It show on Friday. The is, second, is you said? A, is that? Uh, October the 6th. Oh, the 6th. I'm sorry. The 6th. Between sixth. after sixth, the 5th. Yeah, we're from New Zealand. Seven. The 6th. Okay, yeah, October 6th. Sixth. Yeah. And we can do that through your Facebook page, you said. Yeah, yeah. Come, uh, Facebook and Twitter and the website. Basically, anything with Like a Storm attached to it. We'll oh, there will be a link there. Hook you up with the dates. And then in November, we'll be back on our headline tour. On the Didgeridoo Destruction, Destruction Tour. Awesome. So we'll be seeing uh, official dates for that coming up here pretty soon. Very, Very soon. soon. Momentarily. Right. Good, because that was just announced this morning. It was. So good. Just I kind of kind of feel like we're like on the inside track. You're here. on the cusp, man. Yeah. You're, on the, you're, you're, you're this close to finding out. I love it. I love it. Well, thank you guys for coming in. It's always good to see you. Can we not like wait six months in between next time? Good idea. I mean, if you're gonna be here in a couple of months, you should probably come back. We yeah, probably Thursday. should. We'll just stay here until November. Yeah. yeah, that's cool too. Yeah, we'll just we'll sleep behind the piano. Perfect. We got we got plenty that's of pretty plenty comfy of room. down there. If you can make it national drink beer day every day, we'll we'll, well, we'll just make here. it our own private yeah. holiday. We'll next time you. you're here. All right. Or <laughs> Drink tomorrow. Like whatever. Whatever. Drink, yeah. like oh, Drink like a pirate day. Drink like a pirate day. Drink like a pirate day. Oh, yeah. Now we're on to something that could be like the, the national like a storm holiday. That's it. I love it. Well, thank you guys again. We'll thank see you, you Thursday Thanks night. Thanks for having us. And then uh, we'll see you again in just a couple of months. Live in Studio East with Like a Storm, 95 Will Rock, The Rock Station. W-I-R-A.